Richard Noller last updated 1647, September 24, 2017 Number 8 Rebecca Todd scored a try during Canterbury's 32-29 pulsating victory over County's Manukau in Pukaka on Saturday. If Wayne Love felt like wrapping his head in his hands when the Canterbury women's rugby team trailed County's Manukau 245 on Saturday, he wasn't saying it. Clearly Love knew something that the rest of us didn't. Because Canterbury dragged back their way back from the halftime deficit in the Farrah Palmer Cup match to beat national provincial champions 32-29 in Pukaka, and in doing, so they hauled the J.J. Stewart Trophy back to Christchurch. Despite his optimism which proved well-founded, when Canterbury roared back with three tries after the hell-time break Love was still made to sweat. Although Canterbury took the lead with around 10 minutes remaining, they did their best to blow their hard work when counties immediately replied with a try after the restart. In the end it's required a try from fullback Grace Brooker, with three minutes remaining, to earn Canterbury their success and the fact that the visitors scored five of their six tries through their backs vindicates their decision to play an expansive game. It also says a lot about their fitness and ability to stay focused when others might have curled up and started whining about life not being fair. With counties being quite a bit bigger and not quite so mobile around the paddock, that is where we wanted to go with it, the game plan, Love said. And, certainly, in the second half, it worked well. Canterbury had to overcome their share of grief in the early scrums, but they got that right. The line-out also got better, to the point where counties opted to throw to the front and had possession stolen from them in the second spell. If goal kicker Kendra Cox Edge had more success with the boot, she banged over just one conversion, the visitors would have won by more. Love wasn't complaining. Not about her low kicking percentages, or the fact his side made such a slow start. Even though we were down 245 at the break, I still thought we were in it. We just gave away too many penalties, around 8, at the breakdown. It turned out to be an easy fix. Don't commit so many players to the rocks, fan out in defense, and if you get the ball give it some air. We identified a bit of space out wide, and that is reflected in the wingers and fullback scoring four of the tries. Next up for Canterbury or Tosman, with the J.J. Stewart Trophy up for grabs at Ami Stadium. The game is the curtain raiser to the men's side's rank for Lee Shield defense against Wicato. Canterbury 32 Melanie Puckett, Sam Curtis 2, Rebecca Todd, Kendra Cox Edge, Grace Brooker tries Cox Edge Con County's Manukau 29 Sarai Murray Wihangi, Atiro Amadao, Yatu Malama Antonio, Ariana Marino, T. Kuram Gatai Arangamate tries Hazel 2 Bitu Khan. HT 245 Stuff.